everyone welcome to my channel if you're a returning subscriber welcome back and if you're a new subscriber hi my name is mana underscore v hi i just did my skincare routine i think you guys saw that uh today i have a few things to do but um i want to first start by putting in a cute hair band wig from alpine hair they sent me some um some goodies besides the hair they sent me this really cute bag guys how cute is this i'm gonna use this as a makeup case and inside there is i think hair instructions uh hair instruction lashes i think lashes are like a must um a brush for your edges wow this one is, has a little spatula at the back I like this one. I like this one. And um uh, uh, a cute clip, I don't know if you guys can see that, and a rat tail comb. Uh and some strokings. Uh and it also gave me some headbands. Let me just show you the headbands. Oh, she's so loud. Oh my god, they literally fell. All of them. I have this. There's this one. There's also this one. This one reminds me of a dress that I used to like wearing when I had, I just had my son, my firstborn, which is called Kani. And there's also a yellow one. And they also gave me a little oh, hairband. Good boy. Let me just put on my hair and then we will go. So this is the hair. It comes in this secure plastic sleeve but this is a 14 inch um hairband wig and it is the texture is curly yeah this is the texture oh she's pretty and uh i think if you have natural hair and uh you just want to maybe protect style like you want to do a protective style and but still wear hair out i think this will work perfectly and the length actually makes so much sense this is the inside of the hair can you all see it this is the inside of the hair and it has these velcro ties but before i put on the hair i think i'm just gonna prep it this Ah, I love this hair actually. Uh, the reason why I'm wearing, uh, the reason why I'm wearing this wig uh, or wearing a wig today is because uh, my hair is at that stage where it needs to be relaxed, and I don't want to style it right now because I'm low key like pushing it, if that makes sense. Um, because it needs a relaxer, but I haven't elapsed my relaxer time, so. I'm currently like trying to push my op yeah, push my relaxers to um, six to seven weeks because I have fine hair and yeah, 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 all of that. So the reason why I'm wearing this wig is because I low-key want to just protect my hair until I can relax it so I can go back to styling it if that makes sense. Uh, and I feel like that's where wigs come in handy for me. Uh, so we are going to first prep the hair this is like a this is like a bob if that makes sense like this is like an f not a curly bob yeah and the quality of the hair is actually really good i like i'm i'm, I'm actually liking the quality of the hair i'm just spritzing this water so that uh it just has like a a bounce to it like sometimes i feel like when you just wear a wig like this and you don't spray water or manipulate the curls it looks plasticky if that makes sense it just looks wrong so what we're gonna do is this oh, my bottle has an issue guys i just got an email that's exciting um <laughs> okay guys um let me uh focus so i'm going to I'm not gonna use any gel on my hair honestly because you know what I need to stop being reckless with my hair
this could be my everyday hair like this could literally be my everyday hair but uh, if you are interested and you want to get this hair and i feel like this hair is actually really affordable uh please check alpine hair all the description box <laughs> all the details that have to do with the hair will be in my description box down below uh you can get the hair from the back you see it's not stiff stiff wear stiff wear this actually looks like my hair i feel like if you are a natural hair girl this is the perfect length of hair to get when you want to protect your, protect your style especially like it's really cold and oh, didn't say but you know one thing about me I'll sit, I'll sit the whole day and cry that i'm ugly but when i see myself i'm like mm -hmm. uh, so this is the hair guys i think if you want a bigger like a bigger afro or a, a bigger poof or, or, <laughs> you can just easily easily um what you call it uh brush it out and the the curls will be more puffier but i don't know you can see uh it's moving there's no tangle it low-key looks like a real hair the color is perfect love it love 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 it uh let's Let's get on with our festivities for today. Hey, miserable. The lighting is weird. Let me just try to adjust. Yeah. Um, I got two silk pillowcases. Uh, this is the, the king. I think the king size were like my biggest, biggest pillows. Um, how pretty! This is so pretty. It's giving me quality. I really thought I lost these guys, and I was like, "Oh my god, this guy's gonna think I'm crazy if I go and buy the same thing." Uh, they are as big as my pillows, my biggest pillows. So I have the horizontal continentals in this room. Uh, she cute, she premium. This is proper, this is satin, yeah. And I like the quality, the make of the pillows is amazing. And it also is branded Love Kings here. Uh, if you don't know why I'm buying these guys, uh, that's weird if you don't know uh but i think we all know that sleeping with satin or silk uh pillow covers is beneficial for your skin and for your hair so i transitioned i was using a cotton satin satin cotton um but i was just like you know what let me just get the the satin and what's this Okay, these are my pillowcases. I, guys, I am obsessed with this. What's going on? I'm obsessed with this. Um, Hello. What you call it? Uh, these covers. They're just like plain white covers. Mm -hmm. I have the. I have like a lot of them, and it's the same style. Oh, but uh, just wait, sweetie. Really, just wait. Uh, oh, these ones are just a higher thread count, and they are a bit like tough. If that makes sense, they're not as soft as these oh, ones. Uh, they all high third counts, but this one is just high and Come it's just heavier if that makes sense. Come on. Guys, now who bit me up. He's ready. Already, who bit me? You can go, Papa. You can go. Let me finish here so we can. Let me show you my lights, guys. I don't know if you guys are like follow me on Instagram, but I have been so confused on which lights to buy this thing is huge but anyway um i had three options i had the rustic um one that i saw at Corey craft 
and I just couldn't find the color that I was looking for and I had looked at every Cory Carter and I was like you know what this is probably a sign because my husband wasn't feeling those ones um, maybe I shouldn't get them and then my second option was this one no actually my second option was one from Block and Chisel which was on the very very pricey side um, and it happened that when I went to go look for it, it one there was one and one was sold out, and it was just irritating me. And I was at a point where I'm just like, I need to leave this place with lights. So I went at home, and these were in stock. But I'm still gonna purchase my second option. Uh, when I finally get around to buying my second option, I'm going to move these ones to another room and use those ones. I will also show you the pictures here but I feel like if I show you the pictures guys you guys are gonna finish them and I'm not gonna be able to get them <laughs> so I'm gonna gatekeep that one until I purchase them and I got these ones from at home because they were available and one thing about me guys when I need when I like if my intention is to go out of my home and purchase something I'm going to leave the mall or the shops with it. I like I just don't have the patience of waiting and you know pre-booking, not pre-booking, but you know pre-ordering, waiting. I just I cannot. And I think that's the one thing that irks me about getting a new iPhone because the trauma that I experienced when trying to get my the phone that I have was honestly like I couldn't stand it. But anyway, um, like for me, these are like old glam Parisian chateau vibes. Uh, they are quite big. <laughs> they are very big for my liking. Like not for my liking, but in general, they're just like huge. Um, so these are the lampshades. Uh, there's two of them. And yeah, I'm quite happy about them. But uh, they're not going to stay in here. They won't. I'm just doing it in J, you know, just to make myself happy. But these are the, the, this is the lamp. I don't know if you can, my battery is flashing. What the hell? Mommy, um, mommy. Guys, I have to quickly change the boys and leave. It looks like it's about to rain. It's becoming gloomy. I don't know what's going on. But I'm late, so I will make my bed when I come back. How crazy. Delayed, and I was waiting for my battery to charge. So I'm quickly going to go change the boys, leave, and I'll come back, make the bed with you guys. And, um... <laughs> I just came back oh my wig is about to fall off I just came back um, <laughs> uh, I don't think we will continue with making the bed today because um, Gungani was not enjoying himself he's not feeling well so I'm putting my energy into looking after him and uh, I'm just gonna chill and eat um, and finish eating and I think we will we will make the bed gone so guys I'm tired I'm tired literally tired let me show you my salad um, this is my first meal of the day yay 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 and last literally last 
it's actually just so weird guys like i've been i think i've been eating like almost very healthy and doing all of this for like two weeks and i was meant to go on my period in like two weeks i'm on my period right now i just started my period it's so strange it's weird i'm like so freaked out but i don't know how to feel about it but yeah i'll see you tomorrow guys good night Hey guys how are you welcome to today um i'm having a very slow day today honestly it is super slow let me fix what this let me just fix this because now it's making it seem like it's night but i'm having a very slow day i'm having a very slow day uh it's just me my husband and the kids and um actually i've been chilling the most of the day honestly um i also just changed my bedding put up my lamps and i think i'm gonna take the kids to the park i think that's what i'm gonna do <laughs> guys he's so sure that he's flying <laughs> Guys, I'm sitting on the floor. I'm so cold. Uh, the sun is going down now. And earlier on, I saw one piece of sun. One piece of sun. Did I not wear a dress thinking that it's summertime? <laughs> and it is freezing. Even this jersey is not helping, guys. That's how cold it is. But I'm about to go to the shops. And before I go to the shops, since this vlog, this vlog is very chilled, I wanted to show you some stuff that I got. Um, I think things that have accumulated. Let me just say things that have accumulated. Can you see me here? Things that have accumulated like these past months, mainly for winter purposes, guys. Can I tell you? If I don't ramble, I will put this part. I was on like this whole thing that I'm going to prep for winter, I'm going to buy winter stuff and I'm going to be ready for winter. I'm going to be pretty the whole winter and you know, I'm just going to be together. Guys, 
first of all i have gained a lot of weight i have gained a lot of weight like i don't want you to to think i'm speaking negatively about myself i'm just bringing it up as it's one of the factors that has made me just don't want to buy clothes for myself if that makes sense uh so i gained a lot of weight even though i tried buying stuff i was just like but I shouldn't be this weight, if that makes sense. Like, I, I shouldn't be here. Like, why am I buying clothes that I don't even feel good in? So I kind of stopped halfway. But there are things that I've bought that I want to share with you. And uh, hopefully I get to try one of them. I don't want to try anything, honestly. Like, I'm fully, like, I'm not even going to lie to you. I'm not in the space it's too cold so I'm just going to show you I'm not gonna be um what you call it I'm not going to be trying out I hope I look fine here I am a bit far my camera is far I hope you guys can hear me since you guys are always complaining about me being too close I put my camera very far so <laughs> let me show you what I got I was doing my nails in here yesterday and it was so cold but it was so quiet because <laughs> my kids are like on the other side and i was just like i need to spend more time in here like oh my god my kids can't be in my head uh so i appreciate being in here actually so before they budge in let's get to it so i don't know if you guys actually i don't know if you guys have seen this I've worn this in a vlog. I got this at Poetry. A lot of people asked me. It came in. Um, it came in. Yes, I got it at Poetry. I got, mine is in a medium. It came in. How many size? It came in a blue and I think a green. Like a Bottega green. And I wanted this fuchsia pink because I was going to a, to a pink event. But I am so happy for buying this. Because on Wednesday, I have a um event where i'm supposed to wear pink and she's coming in handy so uh, i'm happy that i purchased this jersey and i also bought another knit a very cute knit from poetry guys poetry is the girl like if you don't shop at poetry i don't know and these things are quite old guys like zindala is zindu i bought them like it's been months to show by how like i'm interested i am let me just check the dates i'll tell you <laughs> you'll know <laughs> um this was long long time ago it was two weeks two months ago <laughs> um i also got this one <gasps> this orange one it is so cute guys but it seems so big but i did fit it on it looks big what size did i take I took a small mm, and she looks big but this orange one oh my god it is perfect i am going to try linking all the stuff in the description box down below and this was 7.99 and i think also that one is 7.99 but this is so pretty and a cute and uh what else did i get from poetry mm, guys oh my the cans uh who are looking for wax jeans guys i usually buy my denim from zara and uh one thing about zara can say size wise like they very touch and go when it comes to inclusivity of like bigger girls but i still like the denims and i'll like i'll always like go to look <laughs> like i'm not gonna say i'm cutting them off but um when i was when i was trying to buy wax black jeans from zara I could never find a size like either they were too like stuff or they just didn't fit right and the other day when I was at poetry I saw these and I was like I need to get those I need to get those uh, they fit perfectly they are high-waisted they stretch I, I took um I took a 14 I could have gone with a 12 and now that i've lost weight i honestly could have gone with the 10 they are super stretchy like aren't is super stretchy even when i'm wearing them i almost feel like they're i'm not wearing jeans if that makes sense like i don't feel like i'm snatched if that makes sense it feels like i'm wearing 
loose pants so for me i could have i could have went with the top honestly because i am a 12 but get i could have went to the 12 or a 10 even but these are perfect the length is perfect the stretch the look and feel these are perfect guys these are from poetry uh i'm gonna try looking for a link uh a link to see if they're still available and then uh you guys can check them out but anyone who's been looking for wax jeans and is on the you know the plus size spectrum i got you girl poetry is the girl and then we went to h&m and at h&m i got just a basic white viscose uh t-shirt one thing about me i love a white t-shirt and this is viscose these remind me of Lars and varsity uh they were but the press used to sell very similar t-shirts they would have a pocket somewhere here and the quality was the same i just like like how viscose looks like when it when they try like when they use it to make t-shirts i honestly love love it uh it's just a normal round neck i'm probably going to get a lot of wear uh out of this when we are about to approach spring and during spring it's very light um i wouldn't wear it in winter unless if i don't know but i wouldn't wear it in winter like honestly and then uh i i got my normal basic zara pants that we all love i got them in black and this time around i got them in extra large because uh i think then when i was buying these pants i was a good 91 kgs guys um mm, i was big <laughs> i i still am on the bigger spectrum right now but i was 91 kgs and uh large was never gonna fit like large was never gonna fit she was never gonna fit and uh i took extra large they were actually quite comfortable and uh i liked the fit of extra large but now that i am not 91 kgs anymore i don't know how to i feel like they'll still fit but they will not be as like like the large if that makes sense and then i got them in a like a creamish white beige it's not white like the ones that i have i don't know this is like a nude more than it is a white but it's in the middle so i also got them in this and i also got these ones in extra large is it extra large i got these in extra large and then um oh i also oh guys h&m you know guys if if i've never mentioned this i go to h&m every every time i go to the mall where there's h&m in hopes to find good stuff because people always say that h&m has nice things and every time i go to h&m i'm just like when's the island like i honestly cannot see these nice things that everyone is speaking about i think maybe like when um they do collaborations maybe i never get the time i never keep tabs honestly uh, i'm just like i feel like they always like especially in their campaigns it's always like cool people it's very far from me uh i will never get to like i'm i'm not i'm not gonna go stand in the line for that so uh, i never get to experience their collections if i can say that so uh maybe i can say the collection pieces are nice but uh when i go to the store and it's just normal day i cannot find anything like guys there's i'm sure there's no there's, there's no h&m i've never been to like in cape town at this point like i go to every h&m if i see h&m i want to go because i want to find something but first i'm rambling when i went to h&m that day i was finding things i was literally finding things so i've been on the quest to find like mommy wide leg white jeans that are not stretchy but like comfortable and little did i know that h&m will have one for me guys uh i think this is the biggest size because um yeah there was no size bigger than this 
because when i bought these they were a little bit too tight and i was like you know what i'm gonna fit in you they are called the curvy fit 90s baggy jeans they are white and also their prices shame you know what h and prices i fucks with uh this is how they look guys i have so even I mean, these are not even like that white leg they almost like straight so many looks planned for this like oh my god oh my god oh my god like i can't wait to wear these jeans actually like i honestly can't wait i am gonna wear them now in winter but honestly i'm looking forward to wearing them in spring summer i am obsessed they don't stretch at all like there is no elasticity but um it would be a lie if i said i don't love them i love them they're not too wide leg uh they just like per they are perfect guys you know what when i'm wearing these jeans i will try my hardest to take pictures and show you and uh i took a 14 which was a 42 and i think in this style this was the biggest because i was looking for 44 just to be safe and i didn't um find one and then uh i also got a black satin button-up because i am nothing without a button-up like my nail is literally nothing like i've been wearing button-ups for so long like this I, I can't fathom my life without button-ups like what will i be wearing like is my doing i don't see my life without button-ups i got this black one oh the quality is so nice guys like the um, what do you call it the satin is so thick the fabric is really really nice like i'm really impressed with cotton on prices and like the quality and this is going for 329 I, I kid you not i'll be paying almost 800 at zara or 600 like 600 800 somewhere there and then um oh guys i actually have so many things to show you this is gonna be long yeah um what is in here i got us another staple pants so when i was at zara i saw these pants guys i don't know if you can see them i saw these pants and uh i don't know but i these are the same fabric as our big belt pants but these don't have a belt but they're still high-waisted and they're still perfect they are perfect. as i was saying these pants perfect 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 they're from zara i'm sitting by the by the window guys because i'm trying to chase the sun i'm sure my neighbors think i'm crazy and i also got these in an extra large i saw these these i saw a lady wearing these at the polo but in a bright color like an orange and i was like mm. and like they were sitting on her they looked her body was banging like never mind anything her body was banging and i was like these pants on me they're going to do something and i was right guys i wore these pants to a friend uh husband's party and 10 out of 10 like love 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 these pants i'm probably gonna get have to get them tailored once i'm my perfect weight because um i'm gonna be skinny in a few months <laughs> i'm joking guys but um i highly 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 if you love those high-waisted thick belt pants highly 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 recommend these actually in summer i'm gonna stock up in colorful ones like i'm going to get all of the colors um i actually will because i'm obsessed with these pants and then i went to forever new i'm just showing this but this is actually this is for a campaign but um i'm gonna show you actually uh, i got this beautiful uh knitted dress it's like a skater skater style dress i don't know if you guys can see this but she is beautiful guys i'm so lazy to try on like i don't want to lie to you uh she has a little puff sleeve going on 
she's cute like this is a very cute dress like i highly recommend it like especially if you want to uh, think accentuate your small waist or your waist in general i feel like this is a really cute you guys will probably see it on my instagram because uh, i'm going to wear this for a campaign beautiful 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 and then uh let me just show you some shoes that i got i got these <laughs> uh love chunky boots that are short these i was obsessed I, I tried them on and i was like imagine this with the skirt like imagine this with like a girly skirt it's going to give it's actually going to give i got these from zara and i got them in a size 37 as always that's my size love them they're very similar to the ones that i have but uh those ones were not chunky enough they were just not giving chunky they were giving like in between and i told myself i was like you know what i am going to get the really chunky ones this year and last but not least from forever uh, this is also for a campaign, so you guys will see me wearing these. Um, these are sickening. Like, I they look weird now, but oh my god, on my foot, just gorgeous. <laughs> Love these guys. Do you guys watch that lady? She's like a chef, and she's always making like Italian food. I love her she's always like just gorgeous that was very really random but these shoes just gorgeous guys these are like a I usually never go for styles like these like I'm not gonna lie um, these are a like painted I can say painted and even leather vibes let's hide my face because my camera is obsessed with me and um giving it has a square toe one thing about me i actually was very hesitant about getting square toe shoes because i feel like they can be very manly and very bottega est and one thing about me even though i appreciate and love bottega but this stuff is just not my flavor like i i feel like sometimes square shoes can make you look very masculine I mean there are some styles like those like strappy sandals that everyone has beautiful they can look feminine but i feel like when the shoe's closed and it's square it can give spatula man very masculine and that's not the vibe for me so when i saw these they were giving me square they were giving me heel they were giving me perfection i was just like i need those ones these are the ones i need uh love love these shoes i hope like you know what guys one thing about me i will always always get stuff and i will never never wear the stuff i will always go to my old raggedy clothes and just decide not to wear my new stuff because i don't know why i didn't like it like i literally have an issue and one thing about me if i love something i will wear it every day like i will wear it all the time and forget about my other clothes but um let's pray to god that i'll wear these shoes but um not even shoes like all this stuff i'm gonna wear uh i do have a shein i want to do a shein chart haul I hope I get around to it, honestly. I actually hope I get around to it. Because one thing about me, I'm gonna get annoyed and be like I'm not doing it anymore. But um that's it. I feel like I've been speaking for so long. I wanted to show you uh some makeup bits and skincare stuff that I got, but you know what? I'll do that in another vlog. Um mm, what's going on in here? I wanna put this back, but you know what uh let me let me
go to the shops. Ah, keep Zami. King up here. Like, guys, can you. If I. The problem is that my pantry is a mess. But this is what's filling my pantry. But I'm not Pazami Fanda. Guys, I am cooking dinner and the urge to bake is, I have a strong urge to bake and it's like coming over me. <laughs> oh my god, I still have my mask. Oh my god, that's weird. Uh, but I actually have a very strong urge to bake. Like, it's actually crazy like i feel like i need to bake like it's the craziest thing i don't know because i feel like baking is not gonna be it's not gonna be um it's not gonna do any good for me honestly honestly it's not gonna do any good for me because uh i'm eating late now but i i actually am trying to eat well i am fasting it's helping me a lot and uh, I don't want to not continue because I'm seeing results, rapid results to say. Um, even though I hate dieting, but I feel like I'm not really dieting, I can say, but I'm kind of assisting my metabolism because I feel like there was something that was just not happening and I was not feeling great. And I feel like since I've started eating healthy and fasting, it has helped me. But I really want to bake. <laughs> the guys, what must I do? I honestly want to bake. But you know what? I'm not going to do that. I'm actually not going to do that. Guys, I fed my family. My kids are sleeping. I am about to finish off my supplement but anyway guys um thank you for spending a very chilled weekend with me uh the next vlog will be fun i'll be going to a few events and i don't know if i should tell you guys but i have to go pick up a gift from a very exciting brand but um We'll talk about that. We'll talk about that in the next vlog. I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Uh, good night. Thank you for watching. Thank you again for uh, 30, 30k subscribers. I think we're on 30.5 now. You guys are really, really showing up for your girl. Uh, and I highly appreciate it. Um, good night, guys. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Love you.